What is going on awesome photographers? Today we're talking about getting to the shot, talking about settings, exposure, and composition. So let's get started. We're here at Lake Louise in Alberta. It's a beautiful place to take photos and really it's cheating because you can just take a photo anywhere and it'll be good, but we'll talk about that further. So let's talk about the scene that we're in right now. Right now it's kind of overcast, but the sun's peeking through a little bit, so there's some shadows in this scene. In addition, we have beautiful mountains that we can compose really well in this scene. So let's first talk about shutter speed. Because it's so bright out, we're gonna use a pretty quick shutter speed. So I'm gonna be using two thousandths of a second of a shutter speed. Next, I'm gonna be using F8 because I want the whole scene to be in focus. And ISO as low as you can go. I'm gonna go ISO 200, which is lowest for my camera. It's a Fuji X-T2 with a 35 millimeter 1.4. And I like this lens because it has a, it's really close to your eyes point of view and it has a really cool travel feel to it. So let's look at the scene that we have right here. Beautiful scene, we have lots to work with. Instead of just like going straight onto the mountain, what I would suggest is like kind of like showing a tree in the foreground or shooting through things or kind of creative. So come follow me. I'm just going to take some photos as we go. Um, so I'll tell you my thoughts. Right now, I just saw a photo that encompasses three things. It has three trees right in front of us and then it has the next layer being the snow and then the next layer being the background, uh, the different layers in the, in the sky as well. So we're going to take this photo right here. Alright, so what I did, I uh, I made sure that the tree line was just at the bottom of the frame because I didn't want to tell any of this foreground. Uh, I just wanted it to be trees, a little bit of snow on the bottom, and then just like what you see in the background. Next, we have a trail. Trails are amazing when it comes to composition and telling stories because it has a leading line. It can be curved, it can be straight, and that's really awesome for really telling unique photos because your eye just wants to follow that in the picture. So let's take a look at this type of trail we have. Ooh, we have a good moment coming. We actually have a real story to tell um, with these people coming. So I'm gonna put my camera lower for a picture. Using the rule of thirds, they're on the bottom right. I'm going to compose like this left of the frame, this is going to be in the center, and then that's going to be on the right, so let's take that photo. So right now I'm going to take two photos, the first one is me standing, I don't like this one, but if you lower it, you'll get that tree branch out of the way. Uh, the first photo, a tree branch, is right in the way of your leading lines, you don't, you don't want anything of, like in the way of your leading lines, so when I lowered my position, that tree branch is now above the leading line. So, so when you're taking photos, always try to like, how can I put my camera up at my eye or lie down? Uh, always change up your perspective because you never know what will look good. And even just moving slight will really change the perspective of you and whatever you're taking photos of. <clears throat> All right, we're gonna take one last photo before we wrap this up. All right, so for this photo, we have kind of like three big peaks and then we have forest in the foreground and we have skies. So I'm kind of using rule of thirds to have the peaks on the right hand side and the upper right of the, of the grid and then having uh, the clouds on the, on the main level. So there you have it. We took some awesome photos. We're going to bring this into Lightroom now. I'm going to show you guys how I edit these photos, how I use the preset system to edit them. Uh, if you guys have any questions at all, feel free. Drop them below. Uh, it's awesome to hear any questions you guys have. I'll answer them and make videos about it. Rock on. Have a rad day. If you like this video, send it a like. If you didn't like it, well, we have a problem. But yeah, have a great night. <laughs> Bye!